and you know free Burkina Faso. All the way from Burkina Faso. And the back ever got a higher border between Zebila and Boko, going to Boko. Usha, dry season tea. Before now, you may see it coming all the way up. But because of the dry season, it's not easy. You can't even see anything. When you go to the border from Burkina Faso, coming to Pada, you may see 24 hours because the border is still closed. You need to know the border is still closed. 24 hours you may see a tractor trailer carrying tomatoes and onion from Burkina Faso to Ghana. Abra Ghana, no? the farmers they can also plant their tomatoes and onion, but they were not able because some of the leaders are not supporting the farmers. In the real fact, you tell you the fact. So, in the nation, most of the farmers now were more upper east, upper west, to the north, and all the way up. They are in need of a water, so they can plant their tomatoes, onion, uh, a lot of things. And to share these farmers on this area, this farmers on this area, why is it that from your farming? Because they were able to get some some portion of the water, the stream water, in order for them to do what? To get their farming. Look at all the way up to this side. You may also see that it is dry because we are in the what? Dry season. In the dry season, those farmers were not able to what? To plant any food to the country. Now in Ghana, go to the, I just came from Burkina Faso yesterday, go to the border between Paga and Burkina Faso, you may see a lot of tractor trailer packed up there, loading what? Tomatoes! Because Ghana don't have no tomatoes now, even the, tom the tomatoes that Ghana have, it is not good. So they rather go to Burkina Faso and, and what? And what? Get, export more tomatoes from Burkina Faso to Ghana, which costs a lot of money. In our country, God has blessed this country with a what? A good filter. Even in your own house. No, we should go out. You can see that the tomatoes is what? It's planted itself coming out. And the, all these farmers, you know, they need what? The, the only thing they need is the water. We have a big, big dam. But when we're talking about this, you know, those who don't even go anywhere in Ghana, they're taking everything as a politics. You know. When you talk, they say don't talk about my government. When you talk, don't talk about my politics. When you talk, don't talk. Because you don't know nowhere. You don't know what is going on in Ghana. You don't see anything. You may be uh, probably, probably sitting in Kumasi or Accra. You never even travel to even your own village or your own church or, or your own places. So you don't know when people are talking, shut up. Shut up. We are in a dry season. The whole Ghana. Ask any farmer. Now, the whole, a lot of Ghanaians have to be what? Export onion and what? Tomatoes from Burkina Faso to Ghana. I saw it. I was in the border. I was in Burkina Faso just yesterday. So you don't know what you're talking about. Let's go and... So, uh, the, 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 the government of Ghana needs to support the farmers. We don't care if you insult or whatever you see. Them. Hey! You see tomatoes. You see all these tomatoes are exported from maybe Burkina Faso to Ghana. Go to the border. You may see all the trailers 24 hours. All the trailers is tomatoes, tomatoes, tomatoes. We don't have no tomatoes because of what? Dry season. Look at the farmers. We have a big land. Ghana, we have we are blessed with everything. Ghana, Ghana, we are blessed with everything. But it is we, the leaders, and we who think we are not blessed. Salam alaikum. Even the animals, they cannot get nothing to uh they cannot get proper food to drink. You see my mother and her daughter riding the bus. You see them? All these animals, you see, you gotta go to, you see, you see that, you see that, we have the light, we have the light, we have the light, God has blessed us with the light.
I always tell you this. Anytime we go to the villages, I show you this. Able to start growing onion, tomatoes, cabbage, cabbage and uh, what do you call uh, watermelon. They were able to get to Why is it that these guys were able to do it? Is it that is the problem is they have a little bit of water source on the tree. The water, the water, all the way into the water, into their forest, into their water garden, so they can watch and plant a what and plant a lot of stuff. But when you go to Burkina Faso, how do Burkina Faso have been able to get tomatoes? The same weather we have here, Burkina Faso have the same that weather. But they were able to get a lot of tomatoes, skis and everything. So Ghana we have a problem. Always getting tomatoes and onions. They also in the dry season, currently. 